Let me catch you up on the current situation. If you don't mind, yeah, that'd be nice. The enemy is centered around the camp they've set up smack in the middle of the combat area. Your squad will begin at this point. High Commander is still calling for an all-out offensive. I have faith in your soldiers' victory. Your objective is the occupation of the enemy's base camp. Do we have access to that, like, in gameplay? She doesn't really seem capable of taking orders. Is she maybe just gonna run around, do her own thing on our s She is on our side, yeah! She, she can tell friend from foe. She seems to. The enemy's Valkyria has thankfully been neutralized by our own. This is a rare opportunity. Let's make the best of it and try to claim some ground. All decisions regarding the Valkyria from here on out will come from the captain or highest ranked officer present. I see. Okie dokie then. That said... Wow, I don't think I've ever had Rosie be required before. Also, I think Largo too. Wow. Okay. Well, we will do what we do. Bring in who we always do be bringing in. in. There we go. Uh, definitely always a good idea to have a medic. I don't know if a sniper is going to be useful or not, but we're going to go for it anyway. Uh, you know what? How about you? You you don't get a lot of opportunities to do a whole lot. Let's let's see what happens. We'll commence combat now. Stay sharp out there. Okay. Maybe she's doing nothing. We're doing nothing. Or I mean, if they're not able to fight us with theirs, we can't fight them with ours. Because I'd really appreciate it if Alicia could actually maybe sit sit down for a while. She was still shot. <clears throat> I don't know, but that blue flame is the same as that Valkyria's. Meaning she is too, which is both cool and scary. You don't mean you say an Alicia's Valkyria? She opened the door, it makes sense. It looks like she's acting unconsciously. Get too close, she might attack us. I am trying so hard to not make a reference to Ultra Instinct, but I feel like we were all thinking it. Strike their camp. Okay, so just ig ignore her. Let her go off and do her own thing. That's cool. Alright, she can't move very fast, but she is just completely invulnerable. This is certainly something. You want to blow up some of those, those bunkers? I was unaware she could do a two-for-one. That's pretty fantastic. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Feeling pretty happy about that. Now, do you want to also get rid of that tank? Uh, am I alone in thinking maybe we should just let her do whatever she wants and we can just hang out back here? Okay, wow. That man was atomized off the face of the earth. Alright. Well, yeah, we'll just... Let's just have Alicia do whatever it is Alicia would like to do. I like that idea. She she, she just has free reign to do whatever she likes. I'm gonna... I'm just gonna move myself over here real quick and... Uh, yeah... Hopefully she doesn't mind us being over here. I am deeply concerned. All right, what I would like to do, currently, specifically, is blow that up. I was really hoping that would do more damage than it ended up doing. But okay, 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 it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. We just keep it simple, keep it level. All right, we might be able to... Uh, seems unlikely. Oh, no, we did. We did. Okay, okay. That takes care of a lot of the stuff that can, uh, mess with our tank. Other than the enemy tank over yonder. 
Uh, there's a possibility that they might be able to shoot her and incapacitate her for a bit. That would be unfortunate. No Alright, let's have a couple of our soldiers go a little bit forward. There you go, we'll just... There we are, let's, let's hide out in yon trenches. There we go, yeah. We'll just... Let's see, there you are, Susie. There you are, Susie! Come on! There you go, you're pretty adorable. That's always good. That makes you a good soldier. We'll just hang out in the trenches. There you go. We'll just uh, mostly give Alicia her some, some, some covering fire. That's mostly what we're doing right now. That's, that's our main goal. Alright, can we get Vice over to Yon Bunker? We can. Fantastic. Okay, now they won't be shredded by machine gun fire, blown up by a tank. They shouldn't even be able to get shot by Seema the Elder, so that's always good. Alright, but yeah, it's looking like we're not gonna need all the soldiers that we've got, which I personally find to be a good thing. I am okay with that. I'm just gonna move a few few choice units this way. There you go. Alright. And you just hang out here. Alright. And whatever energy we have left, we'll just save up. If I need to get the Edelweiss out over there to try and destroy that there tank, then we'll, we'll be making that effort. Okay. Uh, oh, and it, yep, that's exactly what I thought was gonna be it. Yep. Okay. Oh, did- Oh, I think she just shielded it. She wasn't incapacitated like- Ow! Oh, God damn it all! I didn't know you had cannons. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. We can- we can destroy that. We can get rid of that. What are you going to do, my dear? You're gonna blow up that tank or that bunker. Either or is good for me. The tank? Yeah, all right, you go right on ahead. There you go. That solves so many problems. All right, so now what are you gonna do? Oh, oh, you're gonna annihilate that dude is what you're gonna do. Oh. God damn, Seema the Elder, I don't know if he deserved that. Jesus. Okay. So. Correct me if I'm wrong, but couldn't I theoretically. You just stay where you are, Alicia. You don't gotta. You don't gotta do nothing. You're good, girl. You're good. Can I just, uh, yeah, there you go, we'll just go right over here and we'll just take this, ta-da, <laughs> now what? She is gassed. Okay, uh, somebody help her. Yeah. Oh, she is still hurt. Uh, mission already over? What do you think? It looks like Alicia's passed out. Can you get her back to base for me? She won't shoot any lasers in this state, I promise. Yes, sir. Yeah. What now? Massive tanks are approaching from the north and south. Could they not do that? Be careful, Lieutenant. It's a pincer attack. Oh, no. He left the camp open as bait to lure us in. Well, it worked. Those tanks fire incendiary rounds. The impact explodes into a broad blaze. Does it? That flame can get at you even in trenches and takes a while to die down. 
All right, Ike is in a terrible position right now. Change of plans, Sevens. Hold the camp and take down those tanks. That's optimistic. That's very optimistic, Welkin. Okay. Where are said enemies? I don't know. A trooper elite? What 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 are we looking at here? We're looking at Oh. Well, that is worrying. Okay. Let's um Let's just take this one step at a time. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm I'm impressed, but not surprised. Okay. Okay. How much energy do I have? A lot. A lot. Okay. Don't mind me. I take issue with the fact that that just happened. All right. Deep breaths. Deep breaths. Just because we look screwed doesn't mean we are screwed. I guess sometimes enemies are just going to dodge what you do. How on earth they managed to dodge a sniper shot seems strange to me, but if it be what it be. All right. Okay. Let's go back on in. And take another shot. Just keep shooting. Just keep shooting. That's my current idea. All right. Here's what we're going to do next. Ramsey, you are going to give her more ammo. There you go. All right, all right, all right. Then we're going to hide over here. That's still a problem. A very serious problem indeed. But, uh, okay, just, uh... Keep on, keep it on, keep it on, keep it on. And... Alright. I'm trying to remain calm, despite the fact that I'm honestly currently deeply worried. Uh, you know what we could do? And I probably should have used some of this energy for that end. Let's get Ramsey... All the way over here. All right. There we go. I like machines. All right, all right, all right. The enemy tank shouldn't be able to get over here and do too much. Theoretically. This is all merely in theory. All right, they are all aiming right at her. Woo! All right, okay. Next up, next up. If and we can, let's just go ahead and kill the scouts too. Was the game anticipating me moving my entire army way over there? I do not know. I do not know. All that I am certain of in this life is that because I left as many people back here as I did... I am now dealing with, like, I don't even know, what was that, like, six? Six or seven less enemies than I otherwise would have had to. So that's good. Okay. Next, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna turn the shamrock around like this. So that its exposed weak point isn't just right all up in there. Uh, how are we when it comes to damage? Can we even hit this thing? Is that something we're going to be able to do? Mm, 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 mm. Not a lot. Not a lot. Not a lot. Not a lot of damage. Okay. I will now stash away the 12-year-old with a machine gun. 
All right, she's ready to go real fast, which is good, because we need her to get the hell out of here. All right. Okay. I have no choice. Let's end the phase and see what happens. Yep. No reinforcements. Always good. Reinforcements have appeared anyway, apparently. Uh, oh. Well. That's mightily unfortunate is what that is. Uh, so now, <laughs> oh, there's even more, there's even more, I could screwed. I can't get anybody over there to save her. I mean, I guess maybe Alicia, but then she'll just get, sh no, I don't have Alicia, I mean, uh, uh, Susie. Oh God, why are there so many? Why are there so many? This. I, I took out every single last one of them, and it meant nothing. Why can you shoot that far? Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. We'll save you. We'll save you. I'll start over this whole damn mission if I can. Okay, so we've just got about a bajillion dudes. Whoa, chilling out over there. Okay. Off they go. Mm hmm. All right. Return fire. All right. That's good. That's good. That's good. Any enemies taken out on their turn? Always a plus. Here come the troopers. Here come the troopers. More mobile than you'd think. Alright, they're just running more scout elite. Maybe Aisha can take care of them too. Oh nope, they are they are bolting an entirely new direction. They are they're taking things into a bold new direction is what they're currently doing. Okay. The smallest of constellations right now is the fact that that bunker over to the west isn't actively shooting the Edelweiss. That's nice. The bad news would be quite literally everything else, but you know, aside from that... Okay... How many people are over there and why? All right, so very real. There's like an army over there. Um, real deal, true question of the of the day. Uh, objectives. They, they they said keep that camp. Do I really need to keep that camp, or can I just you know get Rosie to run over there, save Ika, and then we can run away? Okay, rude. Don't do that. I would very much like to just grab Ika and leave. Man, that scout is booking it. They sure are. Okay, cool. Damn, we lost the base. So round over because of that. In my defense, I don't know. Maybe this was like some kind of story, like sort of situation where the game was just like, oh, look at her crazy power. It's gonna, it's gonna do some things and go on. I, I didn't realize I was going to have a very large army of snipers spawning right behind us and everything that I left behind. Okay, okay, okay. I can, now that I have some idea of what to expect, I can do this better now. I can. And I will. All right, so I have kind of a super crazy idea that I'm not entirely sure if it's going to work or not, but we're going to give it a go. 
I, uh, was able to blow up that bunker there, so we don't gotta worry about that anymore. Now, what I'm going to do... is launch a smoke round over there. You'll notice that I have positioned Largo very strategically. We're gonna see if this works. I admit I do not know. We're, but we're, we're, gonna, we're gonna see if we can get rid of that tank and maybe doing that alone will get us what we specifically are looking for. That is the current hope. That is the current plan. We are all going to hope for the best on this one. Problem, now I'm going to have Ika not only take the base, I'm also going to just straight up have her retreat. We're going to see if that's a good idea. There you go. All right. Okay. Then Alicia is going to pass out. The way that she sometimes does after obtaining godhood. You know what? I ain't gonna sit here blaming her. She's had a hell of a day. And what? In fact, I'm willing to wager a fine sum of money when she wakes up. She's not even going to remember any of the things that she did today. But all right, okay. You go ahead and take yourself a nap. We'll get the medic over there and we'll save your biscuits. Everything's gonna be fine. You don't gotta worry. Yes, yes, come on, come on, come on. All right, 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 all right. Come on, come on. Yes, okay. They've got a tank, and that's a problem. We gotta get rid of the tank, and we're gonna get rid of the tank. I have a plan. It might not work, but I'm gonna try. All right, so yes, here's an idea. Let's just have you straight up freaking retreat. How about that? How about that? All right, now, Largo, comparatively, where are you? Hmm. Well, we'll see how this goes. I honestly thought that I had positioned it better than that. Doesn't seem so, doesn't seem so. Uh, what if we just give him that demolition boost, you know? Alright, you know, Largo's a tanky guy. Maybe, maybe this will be okay. That smokescreen is ultimately completely pointless. Ain't that a bummer. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. Looks like we're going to be okay. All right, so we have got every advantage under the sun. Please work. Oh, thank God. <laughs> okay. Of course, Largo's going to be in a bit of a dangerous situation if this isn't good enough. If this isn't the end of the turn, or like the whole operation, I, I don't know, man. All right, we have successfully exploded that tank. One enemy tank neutralized. One to go, sir. What do you mean, one to go, sir? What is that supposed to mean? Keep it up, everybody. It won't be long now. What, what, what do you mean? There was only ever one tank. One tank is all that there was. Where is there another tank? I don't... I don't see another tank anywhere at all. Uh, okay. Maybe it's just not within eye shot? I do not know. All right. Um. Entering combat. I would like. Okay, well, there is no tank facing that current direction. I don't see another tank anywhere. Where is there another tank? What's happening there? I feel like I'm gonna get exploded. Enemy sighted. I thought maybe there'd be a tank, I don't know, over there, and I just didn't notice it before, but I don't see it. Oh, boy. Okay, well, uh... High priority right now is I'm gonna need Marina here to get rid of this Lancer specifically. Uh, okay, so that's real cool and great and awesome and, and stupendous and, and, and cool. Uh, like we're all we're all super impressed by you as a person. Um 
But, also, could you just not? Thank you. Sweet dreams. Really not into that idea right now, okay? All right. Um, there should be, like, scouts in there, too, isn't there? Uh, yeah, Largo's probably just gonna die. I thought there was only one tank. Where is there another tank? All right, yeah, woo, reinforcements have appeared. Ain't that a bummer in a half shell? Uh, where is another tank? Oh, okay, cool. Where is there another tank? I was explicitly told to fight off another tank. Where is another tank? That sucks. Um, if I had any idea where another tank was, I'd do something about it. Okay. At least that specific guy. Never mind, I was gonna say, hey, maybe I guess that guy decided to ignore Largo. He didn't. Also, yeah, using my sniper rounds to take out literally any of the foot soldiers seems to be literally worthless. It doesn't do anything for me at all, so... I feel like the Edelweiss is likely just going to get co exploded. Okay. You know, there were better, much more advantageous locations to throw a grenade from. You've made that choice. Alright. Another scout just kind of wandering over. Okay. You go ahead and blow up the shamrock. Whatever. Not too terribly broken up about that. I just want to know where this enemy tank is supposed to be. Like, does it deploy later? I am legitimately kind of flabbergasted that they're all just straight up ignoring Largo entirely. Okay, well, that's going to be good when I do this again. It can't be the tank that, like, Alicia blew up, right? Like, I'm not, I am not wasn't supposed to get that activated before that became a thing, right? Ow. All right, good thing they, they have terrible aim. Uh, then again, they're getting closer, have more points, and more shots, so... What am I doing here, game? Yep, shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Poor Yoko is gonna be in Sniper Central. I thought maybe I. <sighs> okay. There's like 50 goddamn dudes over there. End your freaking turn! Okay. We really are just slowly, 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 slowly going through all of this. Please end your turn so I can find the other tank. That's all I want. I just want to know where the other tank is. Then, it, then when I have to do this all over again, I can at least plan for it. Okay, yep. Stomp, 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 stomp. All right, I have a grenade. Here you go. <laughs> all right, that's really interesting. Can you stop it so I can see where this next tank is? Where is it? It just keeps going. Okay, uh... Damage minimal. Really? Should have just shot the exposed part of the Edelweiss? You're not good at your job. Can the end... Finally! God damn! Okay, so that's cool and everything. Oh! What am I... Okay, so that's where it is? Uh huh. Okay. So the tank is over there. Legitimate question. Uh, how do I do anything on that front? Okay. All right. I see it now. 
I get it. Okay. Take this. Okay. This one is a lost cause. No denying that. But I know exactly what I gotta do next time. Yeah. Uh, yeah, no matter where she goes... Alright, yeah, it seems like it would be a good idea. Alright, gotcha, okay. So, I just need to set it up so I have a Lancer over there and a Lancer over there, and we can just end this thing before it even begins. That's what we're gonna do. Okay. I'll be right back. Some might say what I'm about to do is a little bit cheap, but on the other hand, hey, if they're gonna surprise attack me, I'm going to surprise attack them! First and foremost, surprise! I have a whole ass tank over here! Bet you weren't expecting that, now were you? Alright, now we'll just get right into position. Er, as close to position as we can. And you best not miss. Very good. Very good. Okay. Now, all we need to do is hope beyond hope that we have got enough energy to pull this mess off. There we go. Okay. Okay. So, let's see here. I spend one more on that. I spend three on Tank Destroyer. And da -da 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 -da. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. No, 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 no. This should be fine. This should be fine. We've got this! You thought you were gonna get the jump on me? Maybe in a parallel dimension, and maybe in a second parallel dimension, but in the third dimension, the one that is canon, the one that matters the most. No. No, you will not. There there was nothing you could do. Sucks to be you. <laughs> it's like, mm, we'll just have two super tanks try to pincer them in, and then, oh no, they, they, they somehow some way knew that we were going to do that. That don't make no sense. It didn't make sense. And it doesn't have to make sense. As long as I win, that's what matters. It's not cheating, it's just using what I know ahead of time. That's what it is. Dealing with this in any other way just seemed like a massive pain in the ass. So we ain't even gonna. We're just gonna... There we go. Alright. Uh, Largo, do your stats stay up? They do. They do. They do. They do. Okay. Shame we couldn't get the, uh, tank slayer thingy going, but you know what? That's fine! There you go. Alright. It still took two. It still took two. We win! Go away now! Get the hell out of here with all that! Operation complete. Both enemy tanks neutralized. Hell yeah! I don't deserve that B rank, but I'll take that B rank. <laughs> Woo! Lots of energy for, for level ups. Oh, cool, a medal too. All right. Anyway, Alicia, are you okay, girl? Sure hope so. In a relative sense. It made military history not only with its ferocity, but with the duel that ended it. Yeah, I mean, it went full anime there for a bit. The Imperial Army then fell to retreat, while Gallia's grasp on victory tightened. Yay! I am all for it. Alicia, are you alright? Logan. I'm... What happened? I can't remember. What did... I was shot, wasn't I? But here I am, alive and fully healed. I was unaware that Valkyras could have healing factors. Oh, alright, fair enough. And it's like... Everyone looks at me differently now. Like they're scared. You might be a god. Welkin did... 
Has something happened to me? Tell me, please. Alicia. This is this is important information. We we got to be sharing it. Report. Oh no. Parting ways. It's a report? Uh-oh. Oh dear. Okay. Uh well, let's just let's just see what this is all about. Yeah. Okay. All right. Where do we go from here? Sir, may I come in? Greece. Any results on that thing I asked you to look into? Also, I didn't say you were allowed in. Yes, sir. For starters, this bullet you gave me. Its shape and markings perfectly match rounds used by an experimental Gallian sniper rifle. I see. So Alicia really was shot by someone inside the Gallian force. So any leads on who fired it? Yes, sir. It... Tell me, Grease. The night before the shooting, records show Lieutenant Lanzip checked out the rifle. <sighs> what? Baldio had the gun? Are you sure that's not some mistake? It's rare for a tank commander to ask for a sniper rifle. So the clerk remembered him. Sir, only two of those rifles exist right now. One is confirmed to be locked in the arsenal. The other was checked out to Lieutenant Lanza and has yet to be returned. I can't. It's hard for me to believe, too. Baldio? It couldn't be. And yet it has to be. Again, I, I I believe I know why he did what he did. I just also, you know, hate it. Hate it a lot. I guess it's one of those necessary evil things, but no. Ah. Hey, Faldio. You in? Oh, boy. I guess not. Where did he go? Notes on the Valkyrian race. The anthropology of the Valkyrie. Maybe he was reading up on the enemy. Hmm? This is his handwriting. Alicia must be made to awaken. Uh. What? Alicia must be made to awaken. No matter how much I try, I can think of no other way. I almost wish I had never joined them on that expedition to the Barius ruins. I'm convinced that the inner chamber was built to admit only Valkyra. But the door opened at her touch. That could only mean that the blood of their tribe courses through her veins. Still, I was shocked to find her bathed in that uncanny light that night in the field. Though I doubted my eyes, I never once doubted. That light was the Valkyrian blue flame. Ultimately, I had no choice but to accept the simple truth that Alicia is one of them. I'd already begun to question all I knew. The walls of the temple sanctum were inscribed with the Valkyrie's account of history. History as it truly was. We are all taught of the darks and calamity and how their actions forever scorched the land. This account told a different story. The Valkyrie invaded this land from the north, slaying the indigenous darks and people as they came. Their grasp of Ragnite technology and the art of war were vastly superior. They trained the destructive power of Ragnite on the Darkson's land, burned it to ash, then had the gall to pass the blame for their inhuman deeds off on their Darkson slaves. Wow. Darksons have borne that stigma ever since, while the Valkyrie became godlike saviors. History is written by the winners, I guess. The victors simply rewrote the history books. Yeah. The Barius ruins promulgate a lie to all but their own descendants as hard fact. Reading about the Valkyrie's power, the true face of these saviors, left me stunned. 
Yet at the same time, I can't help but think of how useful it could be to us now. Since then, I've investigated every text and report on the Valkyrer I could find. They lead me to believe that at least a few scions of the Valkyrer must have survived to this day. All across Europa, these rare individuals live and die unaware of their own nature. I wonder how many there are. But history has recorded rare cases of individuals who have awakened to their powers. Their stories share one common thread. All of them suffered grave wounds before awakening. If those accounts are correct, the blood of the Valkyrer stirs at the approach of death. Their power, having slept for thousands of years, bursts awake at one step shy of the end. Once awakened, if one of these individuals takes hold of the refined Ragnite arms of their ancestors, they make their mark on history as one of the Valkyrer of old. I couldn't stop myself. I stole the Valkyrian lance and shield out of the university archive. Supposedly their blood serves to amplify the Ragnite's natural power. There's no reason to do this in secrecy. Lies behind it. Perhaps it's a consequence of their origins in the Ragnite rich northern regions. Regardless of the reason, the Valkyria's life force itself calls forth a reaction from the stone. I don't understand why he couldn't just talk to them about this. The enemy Valkyria decimated our forces on the Nagyar Plains. I could not afford to stay my hand on account of ethics. I had the rifle and I forced myself to use it. I shot her. I placed the lance and shield on her unconscious form. I was racked with insecurity and guilt, hands red with blood of my best friend's love. But now I know. The choice I made was right. But just tell them about all of this. Why did you have to keep it to yourself? This just seems like the worst possible way to get exactly what you were looking for. Hello, Lieutenant Gunther. Is something wrong? Faldio, where is he? Sir, Captain Verrat just called him in. He left only a minute ago. Here we go. I'm only going to ask you this once. Was it you who shot Alicia? Yeah. I shot her. <laughs> Tell me why. Why did you have to shoot her? The people. Galia needed her. Now let me ask you a question. How else do you think we could have won that battle? If not for Alicia's power, Galia would have most certainly lost. I still can't. And not just this battle. I'm talking about Galia's future. How else are we supposed to survive, Welkin? Caught on either side by giants. It's Alicia. Our Valkyria. She's the only one who can protect us from them. Wrong. Our side gaining power won't end this war. All it does is escalate the conflict. That's enough. Listen to each other. You may both be right, but still, you're both very wrong. I don't claim to have the perfect answer either. However, regardless of the reason, attacking one of your own comrades is deplorable. By Galleon military law, I remand you to the stockade until further notice, Faldio. And you, Welkin. Twenty-four hours in isolation for engaging in fisticuffs. Man. 
Chapter 15, Citadel Girlendio. Oh boy, okay, this is clearly all super duper mega important stuff. Yeah. Okay, okay. In fact, I don't know if this is the last mission or or or, or close to it, but we we're we're going to have to we have to check over everything first. Take stock of everything we have. Go to the training field, obviously. I've got experience to use. Alright, alright. Let's see. Uh, certainly an option. Why not? There you go. Get everybody that little extra bit stronger. I can probably get two of them into elite status. Also a new order. Okay, all units aim. I could see that being useful. All right, lancers and snipers. I want them to be elite. Actually, it looks like I could probably have done engineer as well. But I don't really know if I need engineer to be better. Anyway, class up! Let's go! Well, also, I feel like I should probably just have everything. Yeah. Everything should be elite. I'll, I'll just put the points into it for the sake of it. They don't seem to gain anything new for it, though. It almost seems symbolic, but eh, that's fine. That's fine. More HP, more defense, whatever it is we get. Always good to have. There, everything is elite now. Very good, very good. And I guess we'll just stay with that for now. I get a strong inkling deep down in my brainscape that I can probably get a new side story thing right about now. It would just make a lot of sense. Whoa! The answer was yes. Pieces on Rosie, on Alicia, on Captain Varrett, and on Welkin. Okay. Uh, can I afford... Yep, okay. I can't afford all of these. Alright, before we go into what is very clearly dang near close to the end of everything. We have got to do all of this. I assume at least probably the more expensive ones are going to have like battles attached to them. Not so much of this one. We'll see, we'll see. That said, thank you very, 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 very much. No, let's just go and try and upgrade our weapons as much as we can, too. Alright, develop yon weapons. Rivals. Even more accuracy boosts. Our scouts are literally never going to miss a shot for the rest of their days, and I am more than okay with that. Also, the noise that that makes sounds so close to the Terminator sting that it bothers me. Like, really listen to it. That's like, ugh, one, like a fraction of a second more delayed on that second to last one, and it would have been exact. Ugh, it gets so close. But all right, there we go. Aim perfect. Uh, we don't need to really mess around with that. Upgrading their grenades, on the other hand, I'm going to go ahead and say that's always a good idea. There we are. And also uniform upgrades. Let's just go ahead and keep those going, too. There you go. Oh, double the upgrade on these. All right, works for me. Whoa, Largo is going to be very tanky. All right, that's fine. I'm cool with it. There we are. All right. And yet, we can still get tankier still. Fascinating. Okay. Got all that taken care of. All is good, all is well. <sighs> all right, 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 all right. Okay, back to book mode. Let's see what we can do. A new episode, a new report. Gotcha. Okay, well, let's see here. Um, hmm. 
I'm not sure. Hang on, let's back it up. Normal styles. Report. Flower of the battlefield. Okay, alright. So that's where that one is. I couldn't get these earlier. Report. War without weapons. Alright, alright. Just take it back a little bit more. Okay, so Ro I, I thought so. Yeah, Rosie gets one after what happened to Asara. Alright. Report. What lies beyond hate. Man, oh man, oh man. Alright. For R and R. Before we meet with that. Interesting. Report. Signs of awakening. Oh. Okay. So when he was talking, I was curious. He said that he had saw her glowing, but we never saw that. Okay. So that's why we're deliberately going back in time to see what this one's all about. Okay. I am curious. How did he see this? Hey, Welkin. Hey, Scuzzlord. They called you in too, Faldio? Man. Going back to the past to talk to you is awkward as hell. Yeah, looks like they've got all the squad leaders assembled. Must be something big. It looks like all of you made it. You've probably already guessed why you're here now. Probably to shoot something. The militia will be staging a suppression op using all of its forces. A suppression op, Captain? As you know, the Empire has a series of camps spread throughout the Varius Badlands. Each of your squads will work separately to strike them simultaneously. Okay. I see. If we attack them at the same time, we won't have to worry about reinforcements. Correct. Welkin, your squad will take the camp located atop the northern Varius Mesa. Yes, Captain. The operation begins tomorrow morning. Be sure you're fully rested. Dismissed. Seems fairly standard, all things considered. But what does it all mean? How is this gonna go? Also, looks like we're going to like fight on a big spiral. Are we going to Spiral Mountain? I'm okay with that. That's a huge ass spiral. Remnants of the Empire's force were spotted setting up camp in the Highland region of the Barius Badlands. Your squad will split up between the north and south to cut off their escape route. Gotcha. Then you'll have to weather their counter-offensive as you make your way to the summit. Your objective here is to occupy their base camp. Gotcha. Okay. All right. Sure. Let's see. Already right. Again, naturally, we have Alicia. All right, then. And then we will also... Okay, we will grab our usual suspects. Rosie and Vice and... I don't know. We probably won't need Largo, but I'm bringing him just to be safe. And... Marina, uh, can I actually move her slightly that way? Thank you. And then I guess we'll also bring Susie, because we can. And 80, because we also can. All right. I always end up having more people on the field than I absolutely need, so. I imagine it'll be pretty much the exact same here. This one's going to be big. Be careful out there, Sevens. Squad 7, move out! I find it somewhat strange that Welkin and Alicia are alone on the northern side. Usually we're able to do a bit more than that with them. What kind of weirdos would set up camp at the top of a rocky hill like this? One word! Aesthetic! Well, gravity makes attacks from high places more dangerous. Maybe that's it. Either way, we should watch out for fire from above. Death from above! Death from above! Okay, so... I mean... What is even the point of bringing a tank? You're just gonna have to go in a big-ass circle and not really do too much, you know? Alright, I'm sure I won't totally regret doing this at all. Alright, hello over there. Um... Hmm. I'm going to start things off by doing one of these. And that just instantaneously killed ya. Alright. I guess we are in the past, so... Elites aren't a thing yet. Huh. 
Well, all right. I mean, don't mind if I does. We'll just get some work done here and now, why don't we? Like, hello there, good sir. I'm going to have to end your life now. There we go. And starting things off the right way. Unfortunately, I don't have another grenade to remove this dude's cover. Hmm. So I'm left to... Oh, it's an engine. An engineer? I don't think I've ever seen an engineer on the enemy side before. That's different. All right, well, um... Makes killing you a whole lot easier, I must say. Wow, engineers do suck at fighting. God damn, that is... That is noteworthily bad. Oh <laughs> my goodness. All right then, well, be that as it may, uh, farewell. All right, so we kind of need to get a tank up here because there isn't... Oh, I see. I see, I see, I see. Okay, uh, small problem. I don't want Alicia all up in the biz of a tank. Uh, here's hoping that's good enough. I mean, it's going to have to... It, it, yeah, that has to be good enough. Otherwise, it has to blow up its entire blockade for it. it, it that would just be a dumb idea in general. Anyway, hello up there. Stop that. There we go. <laughs> Sweet dreams. And that's how you do that. Okay. Now that we have properly taken care of that business... Let's see here. Largo, you might actually be more useful in this mission than I had priorly assumed, given your less than stellar mobility. Hello. All right. Uh, I suppose I can get right all up in your biz. I shouldn't be able to miss this one. Here's open. Wow, it's an engineer. Oh. Uh, huh. In retrospect, I guess I don't really need to care. All right, then. I won't. Like, that's... Yeah, whatever, man. I can get... I can get any number of people to jump over here and finish that off. Oh! Everybody everywhere would be digging them vegetables. Yeah, that guy could just take as many shots as he wants at me, and it don't mean nothing. Oh, I was really hoping that would work. What a bummer. All right, then. All right, then. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Let me... Bring... Vice. If I can get Vice behind that tank and give him the super, you know, go-go powers, that should solve all the problems. All right, first things first. Get out of here, you! There we go. Just because you're mostly weak and helpless doesn't mean I don't want to have to, you know, just get you out of the way right here and now. Leaving you to do whatever you want would be a bad idea. All right, so what are the opposing forces going to do? Request reinforcements is what they're going to do. That makes sense. That makes sense. And here comes a Lancer. Dun, 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 dun. All right. That's a slight problem, but I can work around it. I can fix it. It's not that big a deal. Ah, second Lancer. I see, I see, I see. Yet again, really not that big of a problem. I could just have Alicia come back down and take them out one at a time. Won't even be a problem. Oh, they got an enemy tank. Whoa, didn't... Didn't plan for that one. Ow. Well, that certainly hurt like hell. Okay, and really... Okay, we get it. Yeah, woo, your Lancers. We are the Lancers! We are the Lancers! Yeah, okay, we get it. We don't care. It's not going to amount in a victory for you, so just knock it the hell off. You're just making things last longer than they have any business doing so. Oh, great. Now we got this dude. Cool, cool, cool. All right, snipers. And, oh, and off he goes. Off he goes to cause problems for someone else. Really? Okay, we get it. That seemingly went right through us. I'm not sure how you missed. No complaining, but it's still weird all the same. 
Okay. Now, let's just solve all of our problems, why don't we? First things first. Get Alicia back down there. Man, that's a big ass letter. Okay, so hello there. I'm gonna have to ask you to not. Okay. That takes care of that. Then I'm just gonna go behind you preemptively because I can. There we are. And we'll take you out too. There we are, okay. Any reinforcements that they call for are going to have to happen topside, so don't have to worry about that. All right, just had Alicia back up here. If nothing else, she's safe until, like if something goes down there, she's safe up here. She could just swoop on down later if need be. Works out rather well in that regard. Okay, next what we're gonna do is we're going to bring forth the Largo. All right, he should be able to survive a small amount of machine gun fire, even from a tank. Try to climb up higher. Or it won't even matter. That, fine by me. And then we did this. There you go. No more tank. All right. All right. Okay. Oh, hello over there. Uh, hmm, 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 hmm. Okay, okay. Uh, ideally, I'd like to not have to deal with any of that. It's another engineer. Oi, oi, oi. An engineer and a scout. That's barely anything worth worrying about, so... I'll just send Ika over. There you go. Oh, yeah, yeah. You go ahead and keep taking your little, little piddly pit, 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 pit shots. And you'll note that's remarkably quick how little it matters in the long run. Alright. Scout Dunzo. Next up on the docket... Is this... Okay. Perfect. Now, there's something I'm curious about. Bit of a bummer to have to spend an extra turn to do this. Okay, so... The lance didn't work. But is that just because it has terrible aim and can miss literally anything? No problem, boss. Or... Can we, in fact, actually destroy these things? Let's find out. Like, I only need one of these things out of the way. Eh, there we go. All right, yeah, no. The lance is just a terrible weapon. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Good to know. This was ultimately worthwhile. Now, what we'll do... is go up yon ladder. Vice! Time to kick some more ass, my guy. Oh, hey, how's it going? Okay, uh, well, hmm. That's a fair few many dudes now, ain't it? Okay, uh, gonna have to ask you to not. Go away. There we are. Did that kill all of them? Wow, it did somehow. Is, are you in trouble now? Uh, I guess, I guess you are. Okay, <laughs> I, I guess there is still a dude shooting at you. Was, you. You seem to blow up literally every stinking buddy around. It seemed like you were in a pretty safe spot, all things considered. But, uh, there you go. If you see it as a challenge, that's on you, Vice. That's all right. Yeehaw! Yeehaw, indeed. Island. Cannot stress this quite enough. Yee. Aha. Uh -huh. All right, so... Hmm. I already used my grenade for this turn. And that was the last of my points? It was not. Okay. So... I think... I think. Let's head over here real quick. All right, I'm going to preemptively blow up some of those barricades for Vice later. Yeah, there you go. All right. Honestly, these two alone should probably be able to take care of things. I dare say they just might be able to. Let's see how it goes. All right, reinforcements have arrived. Could be a problem. They're requesting even more. Okay. Well, it said the tank was moving, but then it didn't. Oh, all right, now we gotta do it shuffling about. All right, he is not shuffling a lot. Disgraceful. Okay, 
So, with all that said and done, assuming that they didn't turn themselves around, which, honestly, they might have. Didn't mean to do that, unfortunate. Okay. Uh, you know what? This is actually fine. This is fine. I'm going to take you out of the equation first. There you go. Less energy. Huzzah, huzzah. You can even have Alicia swing by and shoot a grenade over at those dudes. Oh, hi, how's it going? All right, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Look, I'll get right to you in a matter of moments. I'm gonna need you to chill your swill for but a moment and a half here. First things first. I'm gonna need a demolition boost up in here. There you go. And destroy the target he most certainly shall. Vice has shot to death so many tanks, it is rather amazing. Oh! I don't know what that boosts, but we didn't need it. And... Fathy well! Damn, just three shots is all was needed. Huzzah! Alright then. Uh, now a real good question. Do I need to kill those two shock troopers over there? Or... Oh, hello, there's even more dudes over here. Why are there so many dudes? There's just so many dudes just chilling out over here trying to stop me from taking over these lands. You don't gotta be doing all that. That's entirely unnecessary. Alright. Oh! He's really not, though! You have an overwhelming advantage! Their bullets basically don't do any damage at all for you at this point anymore. Like, you're fine, dudes. Like, look at that! You just took several shots straight on and you didn't even flinch. You got nothing to worry about. Your armor's just too damn good. All right, can you make it over there? You can! All right, cool. We didn't have to bother with those last two dudes. Works for me! dun dun dun, dun. I like traveling to the past. The enemies are way weaker, and I get to keep everything I have that I got in the future. All right, then. B-Rank! Huzzah! Free things for me. All right, well, we did it. Now what happens? The important parts. Good to see you. Looks like you made it through. You too. And the other squads are back. Seems the Barrier suppression was successful. Seems so. Lieutenant Gunther, we've made camp for the night, sir. Oh boy! Okay, great. Let's finish setting the... Hmm? Alicia, your arm's bleeding. Are you alright? Huh? Oh. Something this small should heal up in no time. I'll be fine. Here, let me take a look. You've been shot. Lucky thing it only hit your arm. She's really kind of no-selling the fact that she was shot in the arm. Does it hurt bad? Uh, a little. It doesn't look too deep, but it still needs to be properly dressed. Sit tight. I'll get you patched up. You still need to finish getting Squad 7 settled. Thanks, Valdio. I know she'll be in good hands. Oof. Please, leaving a lady to bleed would go against my gentleman's morals. Oof. <laughs> well, thank you, Faldio. Ah, the irony of it all. Okay, and this is where you bear witness to the glow. Rosie taking a nap. Oh, so is Largo. All right, cool. Say welcome. We're sleeping. Shut up. Already asleep, huh? It's nap time. Eh, no worries. I guess I'll just come back tomorrow. Huh? Maybe the glow is what heals her. What's going on? Because I was just wondering, like, if it shows up as often as it seemed, like, at least in that instance, then I would be wondering how others didn't notice. But I guess maybe it's only, yeah, it's if only you're injured, and that's the only time it flared up. Still miraculous at this exact moment that everyone was asleep. Except him. It's another big day for Squad 7. Oh, morning, Isara. 
Here, let me help you with that. Ow. Thank you kindly, Alicia. Are you certain your arm is all right? Seeing her again makes me sad. Fine. <sighs> See? No problem, even with the heavy stuff. <laughs> well, I'm glad. Just be sure you take it slow. I will. Thanks. Alicia. Oh, Faldio. Thanks again for yesterday. Sure. Tell me, how is your arm doing now? I woke up this morning and it was all better. It isn't even sore anymore. Man, the healing factor is potent. Not at all. I've had bruises last a week and yours was a gunshot. Ever since I was a kid, I've been quick to recover. Bet you're jealous, huh? <laughs> um... Well, just as long as you're alright. Still, be sure to take it slow. Who? <laughs> Isara just said the same thing. No. And then the pig! Oh, hi, Hans. What, is it time for breakfast? It's always time for breakfast. No. No. Waffles of the Belgian sort. Better get cooking then. Well, I've got to head off. Sure. Don't want people going hungry. Does this world even have a Belgium? Probably not. Alicia. Man, oh man, oh man, oh man. Alright. Okay, well. We got that all sorted out. Which is nice. We've got even more to do. And we shall.